So it's your first time at Whistler Bike Park. And assuming you've done slightly more than just ride around the front of your house before, I think, and even in that situation, I think the best run to do first is called Beeline. It's an easy blue trail that gets you right into the mix while not being over the head of basically anybody. So Beeline's a really nice starting point because nice mellow berms that you can take at any speed you want. Whereas the green run, easy does it, generally doesn't really have burns, which I personally find to be harder to ride on. You try to go around flat corners, whereas this, you get to kind of do that roller coaster kind of effect, which is pretty cool. The dirt stays pretty tacky on this run because it's not very exposed, which is really nice. And, uh, Also on this run, you generally won't have people following close behind. Because most of the guys that are going faster are usually doing warm-up runs on like Crank It Up. And then going on from there. It's also a really fun line to take when, let's say you've never done this thing before, but you're with someone who has, it kind of gives a little something for everybody. All these jumps are totally not mandatory. They're all tables. So you can roll them or hit them. Really good trail to progress on. You can start with just rolling over and then going from there. I was just riding this with my wife and that's exactly what she did. Lots of spots uh, throughout the trails to, to pull over safely. If you need to rest the hands. cool about Whistler, if you follow mountain bike culture, you end up running into lots of people you've probably seen before on TV, and you see lots of Red Bull helmets around, like we just passed Finn Isles, who is the uh, world champion this past year for Downhill Junior. hot. Whoa. <laughs> 
So here you have a choice. You can either go this way, and that's hard of darkness. It could be pretty dry uh, and some bigger jumps. You might have a lot of people backing up behind you if you're going a little slow. So I recommend, I recommend this way to uh, easy does it. So let's do it. Show you what it's like. Road crossing, take it easy. So this is lower easy does it. So you'll notice no big berms here, but lots of loose, flat corners, which I think are harder to ride around and more sketchy. Now don't go left because that's A-line, <laughs> which is a super fun trail that I also have some videos of which you can check out. You just want to follow this road. go back down to the lift. So that, in my opinion, is the best first run for someone brand new to Whistler and relatively new to mountain biking. 